Hey, what did we just do? And we dropped our baby off at daycare. How do you feel? Right now, I'm excited and exhausted all in one because we had an eventful drop off. Yeah, we, I can cut to that part now. We are currently taking Noah to his first day of daycare. First day. He fell asleep. Yeah. Because he, he woke up at 5.30. He woke up at 5.30, oops. Um, but he fell asleep on the way there, so we're hoping that'll help. Um, when he gets there, he'll be excited and want to play, but who knows what it'll do for nap time later. Um, it'll be fine, but we're excited and we're the almost professionals there. professionals have figured. We dropped off baby boy, um, but upon, an hour ago. Upon an hour ago. Upon arrival, we forgot his milk. You know, the only thing he eats. So we had to drive all the way back home and bring it back. So we made our goodbyes and now we are heading out to a quick breakfast before I have to go back into work. Um, but we did it, he's dropped off. He seemed to be happy, um, tired, but happy. So day one, morning one, woohoo. Okay, so uh, yeah, I forgot the milk and we had to book it home and book it back. Although he's not eating until later today, just we need to make sure that they can eat everything. Yeah, yeah. Who knows? Who knows what they're gonna do? Maybe they'll feed him beforehand or something. I don't know, but yeah, the his 97 percent of his calories come from milk that we forgot at home. So. But he has it now. But he has it now. Uh, when we got back, he looked very tired. He was ready for sleep. Uh, here's hoping he naps. So here's hoping he naps. If you've been watching the vlogs, you know that's been uh, adventure uh -huh. already at home with mom and dad. So let's see how daycare does. Um, but yeah, we are exhausted. It's only 10 o'clock. But it and feels like it's All 11. the adrenaline has gone through our bodies already. Yeah. So. so it's also going to change. It feels like 11 o'clock because the sun is like tricks in our mind. But yeah, so now we're at a local um, cafe here in town called Community Matters and we're gonna get some breakfast and then we're gonna head uh, home. Lauren's gonna go to work and I don't know what to do because this is the first day of paternity leave without the paternity part, I feel like. You can go to gym sooner than later, we have to pick them up, yeah. so. Or I could just sit at a coffee shop next to the daycare and just wait, just in case. You can also do that. <laughs> Who knows? Anyways, um, yeah, uh, we will see you in a bit um, when we go pick up Noah. All right. Hi. All right, now we, we're back home. We did it. <laughs> this guy had a full day hey. at daycare. Yay. Are you waving? Hi, um, hi, hi. It was good. Uh, the report from our his teachers. His teacher was that uh, he was smiley and he was good. He took his naps the same way he takes the naps at home, <laughs> which is short, but it's fine. Um, however, he didn't eat enough um, ounces. Hey. Um, and that's on us, we kind of filled out some smaller bottles instead of one big bottle. So that's gonna be different for tomorrow. Yep. And so we had a snack bottle when we came home. So yeah, right now, we're, catch him up. right now we're doing a right. little bit of a catch up. But right. we're just hanging out. Yeah. And uh, yeah, <laughs> it was a really good first day. Minus right. some we, technical minus, mishaps. Like, minus some hiccups we had. Um, oh my gosh. Ow, but yeah. Noah. All right. Well, <laughs> that's it. Are you okay? Anything you want to tell us about your first day at school? Did you have fun? Oh, get it. Get it, buddy. Get it. <laughs> no? Okay. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. Well. See you tomorrow. Say bye. Last week of paternity leave, Dad. Say bye. Okay. All right. See you tomorrow. Bye. bye. Hey. All right. We are here for our first drop off for daycare for Noah. He's right there. I hope he's not sleeping because I don't have a mirror, so I have no idea. But he's been very quiet. Um, but yeah, dropping him off for the first solo drop off. Um, it's also Tuesday, November 5th. Okay. All right, hey. Um, today has been a pretty productive day. I would say even busy that I was not expecting uh, with 
Noah at daycare, I kind of thought that I wouldn't be doing anything but sitting around and waiting for him to be chopped off, but I feel like I've done a lot today. Um, I was able to get my hair cut, go to the gym, get some work done, and get grocery shopping. But it's neither here or there now, because I'm gonna go pick up Noah. And check out this guy, straight from daycare. Another good day, full feeds, which means the big bottles that we filled up for him all worked out and slept two hours uh, for his naps. And now off to home so we can see mom. Did you have a good day? The teacher said you were very smiley and very good again. So that makes us happy as your parents. Anything else? All right, I'll have to take a nap in the car for this guy. All right, see ya, bye. Hey, it is Wednesday, uh, day three of school, day two of solo drop off, and I think we're doing pretty good. And then get all the stuff, because we have a lot of stuff. Say hi. Hey. Yay, hey. we're home. Yes. We're home. Come on, big man. Oh, come on, big guy. We made it. Did you have a good time at school today? Did you have a good day? <laughs> oh, yes. yes. Hi. Uh, Hi. <laughs> You're too cute. Come on, bud. Mm, I love him. Yay, we're home. <laughs> I don't know why Dad's still following me with this camera. <laughs> is this what we're doing? Okay, this is what we're doing. Noah. Noah, look at Dad. <gasps> hey. Who has sweet potato on his face? I do. I do. Mwah. Yay! All right, and then now it's Thursday. It's officially, um, it's November 7th, and little guy is there. We are going for our fourth day of daycare drop-off, um, and is officially my last day of paternity leave. So, uh, it's a little bittersweet, because I'm excited to go back to work. I'm excited for this guy to transition into his um, flow and daycare and getting his ounces and getting his minutes of sleep, hours of sleep. Um, but I'm also sad because 12 weeks uh, was a super long time to be with him and I enjoyed every single moment of it. But yeah, so I'm a little bittersweet about this uh ending to my paternity leave um but i don't know what i'm gonna do today i kind of wanna i don't know i want to make the most of my last day before i go back to work tomorrow and um yeah i'll figure out something to do all right bud you ready for school today yeah are you gonna be good are you gonna eat you gonna sleep? I really hope you do. All right. Hey, so uh, the day is pretty much over on typical standards of uh, how the rest of paternity leave has happened. It is almost three o'clock, meaning that Lauren is almost finished with her uh, time at school and she's gonna go pick up Noah today because we're trying to get in the habit of what a normal day would look like where I drop him off and she picks him up um, But yeah, I've kind of done a bunch of different things. I've gone to a coffee shop for some quiet time I went to the gym and got another workout in I also um, Was able to clean up around the house and kind of tidy up before uh, my first day tomorrow but also before this weekend because um, I think 
Lauren's mom is coming into town as well, so I need to make sure that everything is nice and clean for her. Um, and yeah, now I'm just kind of hanging out in the office, checking stuff online. Um, for good or for bad, life is a little bit boring when Noah's not in the picture. When um, he was here, essentially, uh, I always had something to do with him, whether it was putting him down for a nap or keeping him up or feeding him or whatever. Um, and with him not here, it's it's a little um, it's a little boring. There's just some moments where I just am trying to figure out what to do if I'm not at work and I'm also not taking care of him at the moment. What what is my goal? <laughs> what am I supposed to be doing right now? But I think that will fade pretty quickly. Um, but in the meantime, yeah, I think I'm just gonna. Um, I think I'm just gonna play on the computer some more. I think I'm just gonna find things around the house um, to do. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, last day of paternity leave. All right, see you tomorrow, peace. I'm back. I'm back at work. Um, and it is a strange feeling. Um, I dropped off Noah this morning. Um, it was actually a rough moment where he has been getting a little bit under the weather. His nose has been stuffy and because of that um, it affected his sleep last night. So I was nervous actually that I wasn't going to be back today and I thought, oh, I might be just taking um, a sick day instead but um, he is a trooper and he is uh, he rallied to be up for school today and um, he's there now and I came in to fanfare um, to come back to work um, streamers on my door balloons um, yeah it's uh, official I'm back for my first day of school, back for my first day of work, and um, yeah, I'm excited to be here. I'm sad that paternity leave is officially over, um, but I'm ready to get back to it um, with my job. And yeah, so that means one last thing, which is this is my official signing off for my uh, end of paternity leave in the beginning of work again. And um, yeah, this marks um, the end of a pretty fun chapter in my life. Um, I'm excited that I got to document all of it and that um, for everyone watching that you were able to join me for the ride and join me for the adventure that was um, being a stay-at-home dad and um, just being home with Noah and watching and learning and growing and all of that that comes with um, just being a father um, in this beginning early stage of Noah's life and I'm just excited that I got to document it and that you were able to watch it with me but um, with all that said thanks for watching see you next time peace